guys, it's your girl Kitty Nicole, and today I'm back with another video. So today I'm going to be doing unpopular opinion food edition. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yay! That's just the randomest one I picked. So let's get into it. Um, if you're offended, be offended. I have on my Aggie shirt. A&T. That's why we're going to college. So excited, so excited. Anyways, um, please get offended. Yeah, that's basically my point of this video. Please get offended by my unpopular opinion. And that's okay. That's very much okay. I have all my notes written down right here. So I won't forget. So um, let's get into the video. So my first unpopular opinion is Chipotle is better than most. I don't care what anybody says. I um, no. Okay, let's just be honest here. Moe's is not that good. Moe's is very overrated just because it was like I think it was out before Chipotle was. I'm not like sure. But I think it was out before Chipotle. But Moe's is really disgusting. Like I personally hate it. I've been like twice and I will never go back. If anybody says Moe's or Chipotle, I'm gonna pick Chipotle. Like, I don't eat meat. So like I normally only get veggie anyways, and I just like everything about Chipotle better. Like everything, like their rice is really good. I like the little corn mixture is really good, and their guacamole is unbeatable. It's literally magnificent. I like the chips. I don't really eat the chips, but their quesos are alright. Now if I had to pick queso, I like most quesos better, but like Chipotle's guacamole is an unbeatable greatness like it's literally magnificent now they might cost a little bit more i think i don't know i don't go to Moe's like that they're not that expensive in my opinion because i get a veggie one and i don't put any meat on it so the meat is actually a little extra so mine's like seven dollars so like i really don't complain it's actually really good i don't get drinks though because drinks cost too much but chipotle is better than most and that's just that okay that is simple like ugh i don't know how people even compare those literally most is disgust disgusting okay Chili's and Applebee's are done. They're over with. They're not even thought of, thinkable, none of that. I went to Chili's about three weeks ago to get a pasta. My pasta was cold. It wasn't that good. I was very upset with the service. My waitress was really good, but they were just slow. Like, Applebee's is slow. Chili's is slow. They're just slow. They're not really inviting restaurants anymore like they used to be. I never really liked Applebee's. The only thing I get Applebee's is their bonus wings. Now, I haven't been to Applebee's in like two, three years, but their bonus wings are hitting. But other than that, I, they're, bo they're both canceled. Like, they're done. You're never going to catch me at Applebee's or Chili ever again in my life. They're whack. They are done with, like, period. Ew. I haven't said that word in forever. They're over with. I'm not even ever going back there. Like, Chili's has some good bread, though, but their chips were stale. Their guacamole was disgusting when I got my little pasta, and I was just fed up with the entire experience. It was literally just whack. Like, I hated it. I never go back. Applebee sucks. It's just, that's what I said when I said it. Like, it sucks. Eggs. That's it. Eggs. Disgusting. I don't know how people eat eggs every single day. My mom, she eats at least like two eggs every day. She makes her, she wakes up, makes her eggs, eat it. She can eat for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. That is disgusting. Eggs are disgusting. Okay? Like, I said what I said. I don't know how people eat eggs and think they're like great. I, I grew up eating eggs from like ever when i was like six years old i just stopped eating eggs i was like you're not gonna catch me eating eggs ever again they're nasty i'm not here for it it's just like a liquid coming out of a little shell and you crack it and it turns into a solid and then it's just like it goes in your mouth and it's just like gooey-ish i'm not here for it either like and people that eat eggs they normally eat like either eggs or egg whites in a little container like no like no that's weird eggs are weird and if you don't add like cheese or nothing to them that's really nasty 
I grew up eating eggs, and I told myself I would never eat eggs again in my life. The only way to catch me eating eggs is if I am craving it, and I never crave them, so you won't catch me eating them. Omelets are good. I know. Did she really just say she hates eggs, but omelets are good? I did. I did. And what are you going to do about it? Nothing. Nothing at all. I don't eat omelets either, okay? I don't. I don't eat omelets, and I don't eat eggs. But omelets are better than eggs. I know it doesn't make any sense because they're the same thing, but like the way an omelet is made and like the way it looks, it looks better than eggs look. When I used to eat them, omelets tasted better than eggs. I think it's just, I don't know what it is. I feel like it's just whoever makes it, makes it taste better, but eggs are just disgusting at the end of the day. That's, that's it. That is all. That is it. Coffee. I don't understand how people drink like two and three cups of coffee every day. I don't like coffee. Like hot coffee is disgusting. Black coffee, I'm not even going to drink coffee black without anything in it. Nasty. I drank coffee for a little bit going up and never will drink it again. I do not like hot coffee. I think it's like disgusting to me. Too much sugar, too much creamer, not enough, not enough. Da, 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 da. At the end of the day, it's not that great. Iced coffee is good. I will give you that one. I like iced coffee. Certain. It's got to have from a certain spot now. I just, I don't like coffee. I just think it's nasty. People drink it like every morning when they wake up. Going to work, let me get my cup of coffee. Mm -mm, no, that's nasty. Like coffee is not that good. I just don't find it pleasing. Like it doesn't please me as a drink to drink in the morning before I go to work or school. If anything, I drink like hot tea, or, like hot chocolate. Hot chocolate is good. It's all right. Don't even get me started with hot chocolate. But hot tea is good or hot water with like lemon or something. Like that's better. But coffee is nasty and it has a lot of caffeine in it. I think. Does coffee have caffeine in it? Yeah, it does. I think. I might have to look that up. I don't know. But yeah, nasty. So my next one is water. Now everybody says all water tastes the same. This water tastes the same. That water tastes the same. They do not all taste the same, okay? Let's just be honest right here. Dasani, Aquafina, and Voss water are the best waters to purchase, okay? Voss water is expensive. It is. They come in like really big containers. They're like, they look glass, but they're like plastic. And they're clear through. It says Voss on the side with like a really cute silver top and whatever. Um, but... So most people don't buy Voss water, I understand. So if we're gonna, cause each container by itself is like $6. They don't sell them in bulk or nothing unless you find them on Amazon. So if we're really gonna talk about water that is affordable, Dasani and Aquafina are the best waters out there. I don't know how people drink Deer Park. Deer Park is disgusting to me. It literally tastes literally disgusting. Like, it's really nasty. I don't find anything about Deer Park pleasing. It has like a weird taste. It tastes like it came from a deer. Like. It tastes like it's water that deer drink, like in the um um in the like wilderness and like um you know how they have a little where they go to like the ponds and they like like at, and they lick their they get the drinks and they drink it like animals drink the water. That's what it tastes like. Like I'm drinking water that goes in the deer's mouth and they spit it back up. It tastes like deer water. <laughs> ew, 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 ew. Um, now, I do personally like Purify Great Value Water. Now, Great Value Water is really good. It's not cheap. It's not expensive. It's very cheap. Good. But if I had to choose, like, Mom, I want to go to the grocery store. Let me give me some water. Dasani or Aquafina. I pick Aquafina over Dasani any day. But those are my two favorites. It goes Aquafina, then Dasani, then Pure. No. Boss. Aquafina, Dasani, Great Value. Anything else is, is over me. You won't catch me. Unless it's all I have to drink. And, I mean, I'm going to have to be, like, in the desert been there for like 45 days and I'm just pure thirsty I haven't get drunk anything somebody brings me a cup of water and I'm like what kind of water is this you like deer park and I'm like <laughs> nah I just died cause I'm not drinking no deer park water nah I'm not happy my next thing french toast is disgusting french toast is nasty I don't know how people go around and be like mm. Well, I, I had some French toast today and it was just <laughs> magnificent. Or, y'all, I'm about to go to IHOP today and give me some French toast. Um, I don't even know if IHOP sells French toast. 
I just don't French toast is nasty like I tried to eat it multiple times I tried to make it I tried to eat it and it just doesn't come out good to me like I don't think I know how to make French toast anyways I'm just saying but making French toast anyways is hard I think but eating it is nasty like so you make the bread and then you put the bread with the eggs and I already don't like eggs so French toast with eggs and then you cook it and it's just like it's nasty it's either overcooked undercooked it's never just right so it's never good like I everywhere I wanted to try it is disgusting to me so I'm not gonna keep trying it if I know it's not gonna come out how I want it it literally goes waffle pancakes bread toast anything other than French toast Waffles are better than pancakes. Everything about a waffle is magnificent. Like the way it looks, it's like the square ones or the circle ones, they just look so pretty. And then waffles with whipped cream is better than waffles with syrup. If you didn't know, get with the program, come on now, come on now. It's just, oh, I love waffles so much. They have a better taste in my opinion than pancakes. Pancakes are not that good. Pancakes are overrated, waffles are underrated. That's just that. Like the Eggos waffles, they're all right. They're not that good. But if I want a waffle and I'm hungry and that's all I have to eat for breakfast, put it in the oven, doo -doo, take it out, done, you know? But the pancakes, you just put them in a the microwave. Like Olive Garden. Ugh. Olive Garden is nasty. Okay, hear me out. Just hear me out. It's not nasty, but it ain't that good. And what I mean by that is Olive Garden is overrated. Olive Garden used to be magnificent. I used to love, like, mom, my birthday, can we go to Olive Garden? Now I'm like, mom, take me anywhere but Olive Garden. I had Olive Garden like two weeks ago. And the fettuccine Alfredo was disgusting. The shrimp wasn't good. The noodles were too greasy. But um, Olive Garden is overrated. It's not that good. It's kind of like done for. It's like, uh, I don't want to go there ever again type. I'd be okay if I never go there again. There's so many more pasta places y'all could be going. It's at Olive Garden. Don't ask me which places. I love pasta, though. I go to Kit Bad Jack to give me some pasta. Anywhere I go, I get pasta. It's just my favorite food. But Olive Garden, don't go there. They do not have the best pasta. I'm telling you that right now. And that's stamped. Okay. Okay. Chicken wings. Flats are better than drums. And I say this just because. I honestly people are like, drums have more meat than flats do. I could see where you see that. I go everywhere, all flats fried crispy. I like my chicken fried crispy. I don't know when I ate chicken, I don't eat it anymore. I have more meat, they're easier to eat, you know. You can taste everything. The sauce is well divided, it's divided evenly because they're flat, so everything is even. With drums, it's like the way it's shaped and then like the, the meat and then the bones and then like the sauce and like some parts don't have sauce on them and uh, eh, mm, mm. no. B-dubs versus Wingstop. This is a hard one. And the reason I say this is because I love wings. Wings are my favorite type of meat when I used to eat meat. Wings are great, okay? Buffalo Wild Wings is more expensive. It costs more than Wingstop, okay? So when I'm balling on a budget and I want some chicken wings, I'm going to go to Wingstop. But when I know I have the money and I really want some wings, I'm going to go to um, B-dubs. And I say this because B-Dubs wings are really great. I think Wingstop has more flavors than B-Dubs does. I'm not 100% sure. But I really like B-Dubs french fries better than Wingstop's fries. They just get cold faster. And the sit, um, the sauce I get, at, when I go to B-Dubs, I get their um, teriyaki sauce, all flats, fried crispy. Great. But when I go to Wingstop, I get, it's like, I think it's a, it's a rub. I get rub. I don't get the sauces at Wingstop. It's like a Louisiana rub, all flats, fried crispy. Wingstop cooks their wings better than me. So, I mean, I, it depends. Balling on a budget or you got money to spend. You know, it's your decision, not mine. You do what you gotta do to eat. Not, I'm doing what I gotta do to eat. Okay? Okay. Next one. <laughs> Leftovers. Personally, in my opinion, food is always better the next day. Not fast food, but like restaurant food. Like, wherever I get food from, I like... I don't like eating all in one setting, so I normally either eat it that night or eat it the next day. Now, hear me out. Just hear me out. Please hear me out. Leftovers are always better than the second day. You buy them, okay, so let's go on the timeline, okay? It's Sunday, Monday, Tuesday. You buy your food Sunday, you go eat it, rah, 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 you don't finish it. You go and eat it Monday. Okay, good, good, good. 
You do not eat your food Tuesday, Wednesday, or Thursday. You just don't. Food always tastes better the second day. Most food, at least. Now, don't do that with no fast food. Don't get no fast food and buy it Sunday, eat it a little bit, then put it in the refrigerator, eat it some more on Monday, <laughs> then eat it again on Tuesday. <laughs> no, because that's how you get sick. My drinks. Listen out. Hear me. Coke is disgusting. I said what I said. I said what I said. Oh. Coke is nasty. I don't find anything about Coke good. Coke is terrible, okay? Um, it's not pleasing to drink. And it's stuff like you can put Coke inside of your car, not in it, inside your car, but like what about there's um stuff on your car? I forgot what stuff is, but like it's like stuff on your car, like you pull your car up and it's like stuff on it and you pour a little bit of coke on it and it disappears it takes all like the stuff away that's not good you putting that in your body and you can clean out a car that's nasty never in my life like coke it's just never been a drink for me but sweet tea is bomb okay now hear me out smithfields has some good sweet tea bojangles has some good sweet tea mcdonald's sweet tea is disgusting if you want to go get some watered down sweet tea go to mcdonald's daxby sweet tea is all right now, speaking on Zaxby's, saying on my list, I finished my list, but this is my last one, I think, my last one. Zaxby's tenders are better than Bojangles. Bojangles tenders taste like rubber. They're disgusting. Like, Bojangles tenders are not that good at all. Like, they're really overrated. They taste like rubber, in my opinion. Because this is my opinion of any video. Please get offended. I'm okay with it. I don't care. Come for me if you want. Please come for me. Come for me. Come for me. Because I'm saying what I said and I'm not taking it back. That is all for my food unpopular opinion. Um, I hope you enjoyed my little list of unpopular opinions. Should have a part two coming because I eat a lot. <laughs> Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And have a beautiful, blessed, magnificent day. Bye. Oh, hold on. Bye, guys.